step on it, Jefferson. We're an hour late for our deliveries now. Oh, have a heart, Mr. Cupid. Look at that speed meter. What are you worrying about? About going to my own funeral. I tell you, here come the cops. Fellas, you keep quiet. I'll get out of this. You wouldn't be in it if you would go where the flowers was going instead of stopping where they ain't going. What do you think this is, a racetrack? Uh, no, sir. What's your name and where's your driver's license? Uh, my name is Jefferson. Thomas H. Here's my license. Uh, may I see this, officer? Terrible. Absolutely terrible. What do you mean, terrible? Well, uh, your handwriting. My handwriting? Why? Oh, now, you... wait, you don't understand. It, it's the way you cross your T. You see very high in that, in that half open O and that. That little thing you put on the end of the W? Hey, what are you trying to pull? Oh, well, nothing, only you never should have been a cop in the first place. Who are you? Uh, according to your handwriting, you have what is known as, uh, well, great artistic ability. I have what? Artistic ability. You see, you should have been a, well, a, a writer or, or a painter or, or a, a singer even. No kidding. Yeah, a writer, huh? A singer? Or a painter? How do you know? Look, here's the book I'm studying. Graphology and six easy lessons. Why, I've been studying so long with... I can't... A man I've never seen before. You can? Yeah, wait a minute, I'll show you. Here, read that. To Susie. And Where's John Henderson? What about it? Well, when you see this Henderson, he mailed his order in. And he enclosed the cards to be sent to Miss Carey with the flowers every day. So I studied his handwriting and... Bingo. Right away, I knew she couldn't marry him. Why not? Well, look at that R. You see that, see that little thing right there? Mm -hmm. Well, it's just like a woman's. She's a Oh, that's great. Say, uh, can I borrow that book on graph, uh, will you let me... Brush up, will you? Oh, sure. So long, boys. So long, officer. Wait right here. But there's a fire plug there. Suppose the police come along. But you always say I'll only be a minute. Mm -hmm. Ain't that a shame? Oh, hello, Jimmy. Good morning. Thank you, Miss Carey. Oh, they're lovely, aren't they? Yeah, I guess so. What's the matter, Jimmy? Look, are you going to marry this Henderson? Why, well, I, I don't know. Why do you ask? No, I hate to tell you this. But you might as well know now as later. Oh, my goodness, this sounds serious. It is. You can't marry him. Why? Because I'm a graphologist, and I've analyzed his handwriting, and, well, he's a weakling. Are you sure? Absolutely. My analysis is never wrong. Why, Henderson's handwriting is, well, it's womanish. He could... Look, let me explain it to you. Your handwriting is terrible. What's that? Well, you shouldn't have been a cop on account of the graft. Are you accusing me of taking graft? Uh, no, sir. I was just trying to tell you that you could make more money on other jobs. Another word out of you, and I'll drag you out of this car. Yes, sir. Oh, my goodness. Oh, me. You see, Miss Carey, it's all done by science. But, Jimmy, what I don't... Uh-uh. Don't you argue with me, because I like you. And I don't want to see a nice girl like you make a... make a serious mistake. Well, how do you do, Mr. Henderson? Oh, now, Jimmy... Uh-uh. Don't you try to kid me. That's your hand. Well, so is that. You're not going to give me away. <laughs> of course not. What I can't figure out is... What's a pretty girl like you doing sending flowers to yourself? Well, I got sick and tired of hearing my roommate crow about her boyfriend sending her flowers, so I... Oh, I... Yeah, it's all right, too. It doesn't matter now. Can't afford John Henderson anymore. 
I lost my job. So I noticed. And I decided to take care of that. How? Well, I, I don't know myself yet, but don't you worry. You just keep your chin up and let O'Brien do the work. And say, I uh, might even fix it so I can get your boyfriend, too. 